messing with the devil, kinda hope he wins God is the one, to the burn for all my sins Sin is just guilt woven Right in the middle of town, but a little bit of time before the sun sets. So I'm gonna drive. It's about a half an hour uh, outside of Marfa, but the Prada storefront. All right, so got there a little late, um, but it was still it was still cool to see. I've seen it like all lit up. I guess they don't have the the lights on um, anymore. So now I'm gonna go check out the Marfa lights at the Marfa Lights uh, Observatory. Saw. I saw the Marfa lights, okay, but I don't think that they were like the true, true Marfa lights. I did like a little research, and there's like two different ways to look, apparently. One way people think it's just traffic. So they, they were still pretty cool. So I'm gonna go check that out tomorrow. Um, or tonight, I mean. And uh, it is fucking freezing, man. Um, I have a heater, but I don't feel like setting it up. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm here, and today's my big day of teaching. I'm gonna teach and finish this song, and then, um, and then do a little exploring. <laughs> I've seen dead people roam in the White House halls, presidents and pastors. <laughs> I am just done teaching, teaching all day, and this is what I look at when I when I get right out the door. <laughs> decent walk to get, uh, I'm in El Cosmico, this, this awesome little campground, and it's a, it, it's a pretty decent walk to get from where I'm parked through the cold to uh, the bathrooms and the showers. <laughs> Here I'm frantically trying to get uh, some work done, I guess. It's kind of hard in this town, but I did manage to go for a run, which was really nice. And what's awesome is getting back to El Cosmico and their showers, the whole shower and bathroom things outside, um, which definitely makes like a hot post run a little bit better because um, it's not, not very hot out, you know, it's only about 62 or 63 degrees even even in high noon I'll speak backwards or in tongues whichever you prefer God or the devil don't know which one is worse hate if for love is like screaming without words Patience is a virtue, silence is absurd Grievance only hurts you, guilt just makes it worse You run and Got done teaching in time to see the sunset Well, well I got to see it from the windshield <laughs> But uh, but it still looks really nice uh, Now I'm gonna change and I think I'm gonna hit the town Good business First stop A little pregame Awesome Planet Marfa beer garden. I don't know what the hours are. Obviously, with COVID, it's a little bit different, so it's very closed. <laughs> I mean, you can't even see what that is, but really awesome spot. Yeah. Wild history, some rough, like body burning history in the back. It was pretty cool. Um, and I've had a couple glasses of wine here, so uh, on to the next. Town. 
And this place, maybe I'll show like a picture tomorrow in the light. I can't really see anything. But um, just down the street there is where I parked. The first time I came here, I just slept in my car. And I went to this bar and I met a bunch of people. That's where we ended up at the Lost Horse Saloon. That's why that place is like my favorite. And met the bartender. It's just, oh my God, so much. And then uh, from there, the next day, I met this really awesome guy. I'm gonna try to dig up this video, like in Instagram archives um, at La Venture Restaurant right here at the base of this hotel. And I got like a free agave tasting it was like an agave tasting festival, which sounds like it's going to be food. Yeah, it was all tequila. I was fine with it. And I had like a $45 shot of tequila three different times, three different kinds. And like, I couldn't tell that. I felt so bad, but the guy that was doing it was like so passionate about it. I'm going to dig up that video. Very aged, so it's very smooth. Got a, hardly any bite to it. All right, and so told it's made from a different, a, a different agave. here uh, I walked out and everything was closed because it closes kind of early um, and that's where I because I was sleeping in my car right across the street and I, I remember there was music playing and there was a house I, so I walked to where the music was, was playing because I wasn't done yet it was midnight and uh, there was a house I was having a party and the front door was open so uh, you'll see it I'll post a, a clip of it um, of that house if I can find it. And, uh, and I walked in and I ended up staying with these people for the whole weekend. I was only supposed to be here for a day. I was trying to get home. It was, it was a Mazda protege. It was, I didn't have a van at the time. And uh, I was just trying to get home from LA and wanted to stop here for a couple days. So yeah, I ended up like hanging out with, uh, with this, this whole like house that every night they had like 30 people over. It was awesome. Um, so I'll, I'll show you that house. It was so cool. And then, um, yeah, and then from there, every time I've come back, you know, it's been like mechanics bending over backwards, people picking you up without you throwing your thumb out, places telling you can sleep for free, people at bars saying just sleep on my floor when they don't even know you. I mean, it's just like, it's amazing down here how like the, the vibe of trusting somebody is, is so strong and then it's just, why would I not want to come back? Stout from Dead Beach Brewery from El Paso. And uh, it's, it's cold out, man. I'm ready. I'm ready for a stout. And that is something else. That is what I'm looking for. Yeah. All right, made it to the Lost Horse, but because of COVID, obviously there's not really a whole lot happening right now. Um, and it's like a Tuesday. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna head back, head back to the van and uh, wake up bright and early. As the rain whispers low, all the secrets we already know. rule is it's like a, a studio showing but also like a house people live in it and and the last time I was here I met these awesome people from Colorado that we would just hang out on the porch um, and then I just remembered that I was here and I met a bunch of people from France that were here on an art trip um, so that house has a has some memories to it want a bar for burrito but they're closed which is good because I would be like severely breaking my diet which I'm trying to be consistent it's always tough each in videos and I don't know I guess it's it's probably time to hit the road <laughs> 